Hello guys, my name is Oso, and welcome to episode 1 of Ninja Knowledge. In this series, I will be teaching you guys the ins and outs of both basic and advanced ninja techniques. Today I am going to be talking about basic front wheel control. The ability to comfortably position yourself and perform certain maneuvers without letting your back wheel touch the ground is essential in many ninja tracks. In this video, I will walk you through the first steps on your way to becoming an endo master. The first step to learning front wheel control is to be able to balance comfortably on your front wheel. To first get into the endo, lean forward while holding down left trigger or X to brake. At this point, you will want to find a balanced position. An easy way to do this is to align yourself so that your back wheel and your head are roughly the same distance from the ground. Once you are in the endo, you will have to actively use the left stick to make adjustments to stay balanced. On the bottom right of the screen, you can see my left stick movements. I tap right on the stick when I feel I am starting to lean a bit too far left, and let go of the stick before I end up leaning too far forward. If you find yourself in a position where you have leaned a bit too much to the right, quickly lean to the left before once again leaning to the right and resetting your endo position. Let's take another look at that in slow motion. I notice my head is getting closer to the floor than my back wheel, so I quickly lean back before leaning forward again and putting myself back in a position where my head and back wheel are level. The second step in learning basic front wheel control is the ability to move while keeping your back wheel off the ground. There are two ways to move forward while in an endo. The first method is to simply hold brake in the endo for a long period of time. Although this is the easiest method as the only concern is staying balanced, it is extremely slow, as well as being far less versatile. The second and most popular method of moving forward in an endo is by shuffling forward in small steps. To perform this technique, lean forward out of your balanced position and then quickly lean back, just like we did in step one to save yourself. However, in this situation, we will let go of the brake as we lean back, which will scoot our front wheel forward. Finally, lean forward again and settle yourself in a balanced position. The more you practice this technique, the quicker you will be able to transfer between forward steps and the faster you will be able to move overall. This same shuffling technique is used to move up slopes on your front wheel. Take smaller steps and focus on not hitting your face. Let's take a look at checkpoint two of Glass by Smiley's 2013 on PC a checkpoint that incorporates some of what I've talked about. At the start of the checkpoint, I bunny hop up to the platform and immediately establish a balanced position on my front wheel. From there, I am able to move forward using the shuffling technique to proceed further in the track. Thank you guys for watching. I know there are a lot uh, more advanced front wheel control techniques that I didn't cover in this video, and I am planning to cover those in future videos along with a bunch of other ninja techniques as well. But uh, that being said, feel free to leave a comment and tell me what you want me to talk about next or ask any other questions about what I covered in this video. I read every single comment and I'll try to get back to you as quickly as I can. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time on another episode of Ninja Knowledge.